Okay, what's going on guys? So today we are painting my brake calipers. I'll be using some brake cleaner and some red caliper paint. And this is how it's looking right now. Looks pretty good. Bright red, you know, can't afford Brembo, so gotta get that. This is how my SI is looking right now. But yeah, guys, make sure you clean it first with this. Clean it really good. And then this stuff right here, it dries like super instantly. So that's good. So make sure you, make sure you buy like the caliper paint or you're gonna have to wait for it to dry. And I'm using this and a toothbrush. If you don't have this, you can use you can just use a toothbrush. But what you're wanna what you're gonna wanna do, make sure you clean everything. It doesn't have to be perfect, you know. This is just temporary color, you know, till you get your brambles or whatever. But you know, you can see all that dust coming out. doesn't have to be perfect now what you're gonna want to do you want to get a bag like a big shopping bag and you're gonna put it over it and then you're gonna open a hole just for this part right here yeah I'll show you what I mean okay guys so this is what I mean when you put the bag over it make sure you make a little hole and then work from there so start stretching it and make your way around the caliper Cause you don't want to make from the start a big of a hole and then you know get another bag because it won't it won't work so you want to do that start with a little hole and then stretch it around the caliper and make sure you prep your canvas in this case my car so you know just prep everything make sure no paint gets on your car see like this right here i'm gonna put more bags right there but it should work. Now let's get to painting. Oh, one more thing, guys. Put tape over the rubber, like this little rubber things right here, the rubber arms or whatever. There's another one down here. And put tape over this, your valve cover. You don't want that to get paint. Oh, and you can also put a little piece of tape over the bolts. Okay, guys, so here we go. You want to shape this really good, you know. And we're going to do our first coat. As you can see, this is what I'm talking about. This is what I'm talking about. Make sure you cover the bolts, the little rubber arm thing, the valve, and that's pretty much it. And don't worry about like getting your rotors painted or whatever. That's that's coming off. T Trust me, that's coming off when you break. The break is gonna get rid of that. second coat in a minute so far this is how it's looking I'm telling you man this stuff right here it works really good and it dries like almost instantly like if I touch it right now look 
it dries instantly. That's why you don't have to wait between coats too much. Literally like 20 seconds and you'll be good. Okay guys, I think that's good enough. Everything seems pretty good. Maybe a little bit more right here. Right there. But so far, so good. It's looking awesome. You know. Yo, I got so scared because I just noticed this thing went up. And I thought I painted my car for a second. But now nah, we're good. We're good. So now I'm just gonna, you know, you can go around and look for any spots you miss and then go over that. Like I said, this stuff dries pretty quick, so you don't have to wait. But all right, guys. Now I'm gonna take all this off and we're gonna see how it looks with the wheel on. Okay guys, another trick I just learned. So you see all those uh, paint marks right there, right? You can just get some, the brake cleaner, spray it, and it literally comes off. Look at that. It literally cleans it. Like we never painted it. There you go. And look at the calipers. Pretty good in my opinion. Pretty good. I just gotta take this off. Oh, damn. Damn, I took off the shit. <laughs> 